Can Fins's ERP be linked online to injection molding machines? Yes. Fins's ERP from Fins's and Shopworks.in from Entrib join hands together to create this success story at DLGM. Diptilal Jajmal. DLGM is a success story in plastics with plants across India from UP to Rajasthan to Tamil Nadu. Here we digitize, analyze and transform online. It's an example of Industry 4.0. Let us have a first hand view of the DLJM, one of the most successful plastic molding companies in India, which challenges itself to become number one, work like number one. The production data of these injection molding machines is automatically read into the Fence CRP, and the same is taken on the production for consumption of the raw material as well. The downtime is recorded automatically. It's fast, it's reliable, it's real time. It's perfect. Machines giving data to the ERP software, one of the first time ever in the Indian automotive industry and white good industry. Once again, challenge to become number one and work like number one. DLJ, Fences, and Thread, Shopwork. DLJM is one of the market leaders, the industry leaders. DLJM makes parts for washing machines, for televisions, for motorcycles and for many other applications. It has the finest machines from JSW, Hayatiya, Mitsubishi, Larsen & Tubro and Milenkron. DLJM is proud to run on Finsys ERP software. DLJM is one of the few companies to be associated with Honda, Maruti Suzuki, Yamaha, LG, Samsung, Salter, and Kent, and so many more. As technology partners of DLJM, Finsys has made its mark and making life better for our plastic molding companies across India, Middle East, and Africa. Shopworks is a front runner in the technology wave of IoT 4.0, Industry 4.0, and Internet of Things, making the machines talk to each other. The ERP talking to the machine, machine talking to the ERP. They have created the equipment and sensors that converts the data from these injection molding machines which onwards digitally goes into Fins's ERP for faster analysis, reducing the data entry by 99% in that segment.